Hey folks, Joey Kasimi here. Thank you so much for liking my page. Uh, this video is just a real quick tutorial on how to use my Facebook fan page uh, generator. And I'm going to show you how to do something similar to this one here that you see uh, using the software. So real quick, let's go ahead and go to my software real quick. And as you can see, it's just a real simple layout. Nothing too fancy, nothing too pretty. It's just real short, simple, and straight to the point. I created the software for me just to whip up some real quick uh, fan pages, and now I'm sharing it with you guys here, all right? So I've already went ahead and pre-populated most of the areas here just so I could speed up the video a little bit. I don't want to drag this too long, so I hope you don't mind. Okay, so let's go ahead and proceed uh, with this tutorial. Now, right here, this first section here, here, this is just for the people that are not fans of yours or hasn't liked your page yet. This is what they are going to see. And right here I have three images that you can choose. Okay, uh, These are pretty cool images that I use all the time. Or you can also, if you have your own images and you're handy with Photoshop or you outsource it to someone and have someone create for you, you could just go ahead and put the link to that image and just put it here just like I did. I have my own image, so I'm going to go ahead and use that. Right down here, this whole section here, this is for when they actually like your page and become fans of yours. All right. So right down here, you have options to use all or just some of them. You don't have to use all of them. Right here, this is just a text that goes uh, at the very top. And again, I have this already pre-populated just to speed it up a little bit. You can use it as an HTML if you're handy with HTML and know some minor HTML coding. If not, you can just use straight H uh, or just straight text. You don't have to use these little things. So I'm gonna go ahead and do it just to make it look a little bit pretty. But I've wrote, written here something real quick. Hey, thanks for liking my page. Can't wait to see uh, your fan pages. Blah blah blah. Right here, watch uh, your video tutorial. And this is just a, you know, it's your option if you do videos or not. I like to do videos, so I went ahead and did a video tutorial here. Now, right down here, uh, this is the video section. If you're doing videos, you go ahead and put it here. Again, you don't have to. Let's go ahead and go to uh, YouTube real quick. And real quick uh, pointer here, guys. When you're snatching a or embedding a video you want this uh, the width to be 480 pixels no bigger than that and no smaller okay this will fit right in the in the your Facebook page because they got I think a limit of 520 I think it is of wide but anyways you go ahead put that to 480 and go ahead and copy the code bring it back here and paste it all right, down here, some arrows. This is just a call to action. So if you're telling them where to go, what to do, okay, again, I have three images here to choose from. Or you could go ahead and use your own if you like. Um, I just go ahead and use these. These are my favorites. These work really well. Down here, if you're giving something away, like a download link or a, a, a PDF ebook or something, you go ahead and put it here. And uh, I'm giving away this uh, this free fan page generator. So uh, this is the link to it. Right down here, this is a, a text that you, you put here. Right here it says click here to get access to the fan page generator. This uh, link right here, or this text here will become clickable uh, for your visitors. Or you could actually put a downloadable, or not downloadable, but you could actually put an image, like a software image, an ebook image, uh, whatever you want. I'm gonna go ahead and use text. Now right down here, this is just for your uh, Aweber form. If you're collecting opt-ins and uh, building a list, you could actually do that as well. Go to your Aweber back office, uh, whip up a, a web form real quick and put it in here and you can start uh, building a list. I'm not going to go ahead and do that today because I'm going to show you that in another video on how to create a Facebook landing page. Uh, but that's pretty much it guys uh, with this. Really simple as you can see. Right down here you can preview it and right before you put it in your Facebook okay and this is a cool little option that I just recently added and this is just to give you a, an idea of how it's going to look like right here this is what the people will see if they are not a fan or haven't liked your page yet you just click on it like and this is what they will see once they like your page 
or become a fan. I don't think they use fans anymore, right? Uh, but anyways, once they like your page, this is what they will see. You can actually try it out to see if it works. And the video is working beautifully. Right down here, you can see if the, the link is working. And it's going right to the fan page, as you can see right there. Boom, so it's working. All right, so let's go back to over here and generate the code. If you like everything, you just generate the code. Now, right before you start copying and pasting, I uh, provided a link here for you to get the plugin that you're going to need uh, for or to be able to use this. So right here is just a static HTML thing. It's absolutely free. Just go ahead and click on that button there. Um, right here, if you only got one uh, fan page like I do here, it'll just give you that option. If you got multiple fan pages, it'll give you a drop down box. But you just go ahead and click on that add. And once you're here, you just go here to the left hand side, uh, right here in this part, and you look for this tab that's called uh, Welcome. You click on that, and this is where you actually uh, uh, paste that code. So you're going to go back to your fan page generator. Right here for the non fans, you're gonna highlight all of that and click copy and then go to your fan or your, your page, highlight all of that, okay, and you're going to paste it. You're gonna do the same thing here for when they become fans. Copy that. Sorry if I'm going a little bit fast, guys. Okay, you're gonna go right here and paste it. Okay, and then you're gonna go right up here. Make sure you do this right here. Click on this, guys. No scroll bars, because if you don't, you'll see scroll bars, and that looks ugly. So make sure you have that clicked. Click on save, and then right here, okay, you could actually view your tab as a non-fan. Okay, let's go back here. Click on the back tab, and click on save again. I don't know why it does that. They don't make it easy, and then view it as as a fan and right there okay and there you have it oh this video is private and i think i have the settings off sorry about that guys but as you can see it is working so with that said folks i hope you enjoyed this uh, real quick tutorial this is how you use my facebook fan page is yours absolutely free have fun with it uh once you create some of your fan pages go ahead and jot them down here Put them down here give me the link to them and i'll go ahead and check them out and uh and like your fan page okay so with that said joey kissimmee peace i love you for free out